so i have um five pathways to this course right this video has been long awaited but as usual i always like to make my final research and bed it before i come to talk about anything right and there's actually something like a course like this that is not like a common pathway course so i have five pathway for people it's up to five please if you should if if i'm doing like this i'm just waking up from sleep but i know i have to shoot this video because these days i don't have time for anything because 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 the first one is if you have bsc already yeah you actually qualify for this course there's some things you have to do if you have bsc like if you have non what's it called non sorry i've told you people if i do like this uh, my head is just booty but i now have to shoot this video don't be angry i'm not being so if you have non medical related bsc yep you are qualified for it yep and then number two is if you have medical bsc right maybe if you if you are if you did any medical related course anti medical right and it's bsc we are qualified for it the third one is if you did hnd or ond but then if I had that, you have to send me your whatever you studied and then oh sorry if you had hnd hnd ond or anything yeah you are qualified for it then this fourth people is if you're in the medical field like whether you are studying maybe you know so you're editing your anything of course you're qualified for it and then the fifth one is if the highest level of qualification you ever have is your work somebody like me and that is the basic that's me i'm going for if you just have just wife, you don't have any other qualification, you've not specialized, yep, yep, you are qualified for it. So the first people that I talked about, if you have um BSc, but it's not of medical background or anything. And the thing is, most of you now that are going to UK, and I used to tell you that it's not about just jack marine or just studying this thing, at least jack out with a purpose, jack out with sense, jack out with common sense, so that at the end of your study, right? So that at the end of your study. When you enroll, I'll be going to change your your core permit. If I, now I used to say it in my video that any course that you study as a master's, whether in UK or anywhere, that can make you to change to your core permit, just know that, my dear, if God help you to secure a care home to sponsor your visa, God love you so much. If not, just prepare your mind, just be packing your loose small, small because you are coming back to Nigeria. Just like the way nurses is in, is in high demand now. If, if a nurse, if somebody goes to study nursing outside the country, you know, before they finish, Depending on, I'll talk about that. Yeah. Let's just use nurse as an example because that's like the common one. A nurse does not have to change the postgraduate work permit. That's why it's you know that that one are viable course, right? So instead of going to UK to most times UK, right? The everybody just says study, study, study. So instead of studying masters in public health, I have a video that is coming up addressing people that are going for masters in public health. And I told my younger brother, so he's sitting on this chair. I'm just doing like this. I'm just doing like this for all of you. <laughs> I make a survey for you. So instead of going to UK to study masters in public health, instead of going to UK or any country to study a course that you know that it is not within your reach, it's better you go for this one. So that's why I say if even if you did um what's it called? Even if you did um uh, BSc, non-medical BSc, you know that some people do non-medical BSc and then they will change to they want to do change to medical background BSc. You all know that. So in that field, it's better you opt for this course. Yeah, you can actually do this course. In your MSc, but then even at that, you know that I don't like people to fall inside quota mm? because you are changing. Because the thing is, because those UK schools, those have both schools, they are just after your money. If you are changing, for example, you did economics in BS and then you want to change to masters in public health, you will see admission in UK because it's your money that you don't go. But because you are coming from me, there are some things that I'll tell you to do before you leave your home country. There are some documents I'll tell you to get before you leave your home country so that truly, truly, you will not blow you. This one does not mean that if you, if you can't do it directly. Oh no, oh, who will blame you? But there are some things that you have to do. You know, so this one is my field, this one is my course. Eh, eh. So you have to listen to me. It's me that I went to bring it. I'll tell you what to do. Uh -huh. You got me. I'm sure you got me. Uh -huh. Then the second one is people that ask medical background. Maybe you did BSc, maybe you did medical lab, maybe you did MLT, anything. That one you are qualified. You can decide to go for masters in this field as well. Oh, goodness. Sorry for the distraction, guys. Ah, well, that's why I advise you not know. go. Oh, sorry, as I was saying. So, if you did um, BSc, like maybe medical lab, which other uh, medical courses, anything, you can either go for the BSc, you can either go for the masters, uh, for the masters, 
or you start afresh like me depending on whatever you want right you like the third one who are the third category if you did h and o and d you can use to go for master so sorry category one two three you can actually decide to opt for master but i told you direct masters yeah you can go for direct master yes uk we give you admission for direct masters but there are some things you have to do let me go bring this because you know trust me trust trust me on this don't go for direct masters there are some certificates you should have to have to get some things you have to do in nigeria or your own country before you actually go for it yep then the fifth one is people that are in the medical field or whether you're a doctor whether you're a nurse whether you are um um you should have if you are shy in the medical field already, of course you are qualified. You can either use it to go for your master's or use it to go for my own course or anything. And the fifth one is people that they have just work, just like me. That's this one. So either so generally any category you fall in, right? Any category you fall in, you have major two options, whether you go for your master's, whether you go for my own course, or there's another third one that I will not be talking about because People in that field or relevant to that field, they might actually try to figure it out and tell you that just leave the work for me. Just leave the work for me. Okay. So if you decide to go for something like me, right? That I'm starting from my first, you can decide to do this course. And the thing is, the course, eh? I've not seen that course in Nigerian University. I've not seen it. I've not. I've not. I've not seen that course in Nigerian University, right? The only ones that I've seen is like to far away. I've not seen that course in Nigeria University, but then I am going to be studying in Nigeria, and that's because leaf suit. <laughs> but in real sense, the course is not in Nigeria. But in actual sense, this course is there available outside the country. And the thing is, this course is more like. I don't want to talk, but then before you come and pay to me, you know, I'm supposed to give you people preambles. You should be like something you know, and that's because this course, eh, just like for example, let's use masters in public health, right? Um, for example, right, masters in public health. I think before now they used to allocate this course to people that are like specialists. It's always available in the master's degree. I don't know if it's before, but let's just assume. You no know, master's in public health sounds like one big thing that maybe it's only for special. Maybe it's after doing your BSc, you can do that one that not anybody can have access to. So in Nigeria, this course is only for people that are specialists. Specialists in bag, 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 bag. But you know when it comes to abroad, they allow you for this career progression, this career opportunity, as long as you can do it. There are so many courses. That I keep saying it, guys. There are so many courses that is in high demand, high paying jobs that we all don't know about. Like, there are so many courses that there are these thing courses, right? We just basically just you to do this and everything. You'll be able to attain this course. Just like people that maybe you can study economics and then you change to a health background of masters in public health. You know, look at that career progression. <laughs> so it's something that allows for career progression. <laughs> yeah, I'm just trying to quote some things, right? So the minimum salary for this course, I've told you people before. When I say minimum salary, you don't have seen no, is eighty thousand US dollars, eighty thousand, and it's always more than that. That one I like to use the list of everything, eighty thousand dollars per year without shift, without telling you companies that are um, hiring. Sorry, hiring, 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 hiring country that just eighty thousand. This one they will even take you without experience. That's where you to know that they are in triple demand. They are in what? Shifu demand. And then when I want to talk about any country that, before I come here, talk about a country that you guys consider. <sighs> Calm down. Swallow it. Let me swallow it. I won't be, I won't be. If I say it, you will go. Because I don't want to be able to research people like this. I won't be able to do it. Okay. Then, another thing is. Okay. But you know, you guys know I talk about one with vocational training, right? That one, I just charge small money. You see this one? Hey, hey, hey. Is expensive like i told you is my course i don't want it to cut and then when i was making me say if, if you if you've been following my community tab and everything you will know since when i started research on this course i have to travel within nigeria again to go, go to school i'm gonna be seeing if is this an equivalent to this is it equivalent to this i have to start calling abroad people that ah, if i do uh, this is the license uh, you know all those researching you mm -hmm. imagine if they kidnap me came from, this one is expensive, yo. I will not lie for you, people. You know? Me, I'm not a liar. I will not lie for you. So, if you would your money for me to tell you the name, Lasson, eh? Hey, hey, 
you will pay good money so that before you even cast that cause girl you will think it so now can you guys see that i've made five pathways for the five different people hmm? that's because for now the requirement is not hard and that's why any any course or anything that is not in the public eye eh i don't need to talk about it because once the thing get momentum now hmm? just like nursing if you do nursing before now before you finish your nursing class i've been nursing school you get a job but now because everybody is going to nursing employers now they now want nurses with at least one year experience you get but this is my course before you even finish as long as even before you finish your final exam girl, in fact before as you are even studying hmm? another thing is you know most of it that is going to uk or us or anything to study most times your postgraduate sorry your your part-time study the 20 hours per week per hour is always care job and that's because you don't see job in another thing this job eh eh you don't need care job for it once i tell you once you guys excuse me once you guys to study in the uk or any country you're going your 20 hours per week is in this job because they need you you get me and that's why i told you that before i allow you to do this course as masters there are some things i will tell you to do in nigeria before you go or some certificate i'll tell you to get in your own country hmm? it's not hard rather it's just to put you overhead hmm? and to explain some things to you because you know it's, it's me that i need to bring the course yeah you can actually if i tell you the name you can go and make your own research but it's me that i want to do this and there's some things i'll tell you eh? so that when you can study it as masters abroad hmm? you'll be earning money in that field and then, do you know another good thing about this <laughs> if you study this course i want to be selling it though this course eh, in some countries don't let me say it you can actually work even as a student don't let me say it okay let me say it okay it's many so it's left to your guesses even in the uk you know generally in the uk you can only you can only work 20 hours 20 hours per week but when it comes to this my course when it comes to this my course in fact after telling you eh, just go to gov. You can go and check if I'm blind. Anyways, there are list of courses there. Hmm? When it comes to this my course, you can work more than twenty hours per week. Yeah. So instead of going to UK, paying like fifteen thousand pounds or thirty thousand pounds for masters, maybe say you no know, get eight, you no know, get two, where you go struggle, and then using that same thirteen thousand pounds to go for this my course, and then you're able to work more than twenty hours per week. If you decide to go for masters abroad this time, me, I mean, you, we are not fighting. I wish you were because you're on track. Do you get that? Do you get that? So for UK, UK that so you pay one color one color going to allow you to be working as a student more than twenty hours per week for a course. You should know that that course. Hmm. You get as a bit. <laughs> Actually, there is low key. He is not sure. I don't go vegan for you, right? So like I told you, to tell you the name of that course, love song, the money is high, yo. Let me not lie for you. So if you know carry, if you know carry like this, because this course is one course that you are made for life. And let me not forget, it's one of these courses that you will do, one of these job that you will do that is like a seamless, jobless course. You are jobful, you have a job, but you are jobless. You know this type of course, just like that one which you know I told you about. It's one of those jobs that <laughs> you, are, you, are, you, are, you are just enjoying your life. They are sure paying you salary. Eh? They are paying you salary, but you are not working. But you are working, you know. You know there are some seamless jobs that they will just say, are you employed? Yes. And then, and then you, you are just in one corner. You know? They will be doing shifts for you because they will feel like... <laughs> Anyways, don't let me talk too much. Don't let me talk too much. So it's, it's, a, it's a job that you just do small, and then you earn a whole lot of money. A whooping amount of money. Even without enough experience, right? <laughs> so if you are doing... Starting from my fair, even if you want to go and study outside the country, go and study this course because before you finish the version, you're like, in the me, and then your what's it called? Your pay is very high. So, to tell you the name, money is much, you and then to tell you the pathway, the money is much too, and then to guide you through. The thing is, <clears throat> unlike the other one, what's it called? The one with training, you might not need me to guide you through the pathway, right? If you pay for the name. I feel like this, so I'll just give you like step one, do this step two, depending on the category you follow, whether you have BS, whether you have medical background, whether it is open. And another thing again is this course here. Yeah, once you finish this course, hmm, you can enter any country you like and then say, Hi, my name is I studied 
please i need a job just stop this is not a cost that you do just like that hundred um the last train i talked to you about is like an international <laughs> this thing you don't have to you know like or like nurses now when they move outside the country they'll be doing what's it called the beginning exam equivalency clinical clinical so this one too you write the exam depending on the country but then there is that i tell you that there's something i tell you people that that you just enter in the country like this jakarta you just start working jakarta as you like because you're always in high demand and people don't need about you so if you know you're interested in this course hmm? send me an email and hold your rapper let me know how this one is expensive because this one i'm changing your whole life story okay? i am changing your whole life story hold your money you first pay money for the training and then i'll tell you the step of how to give out so whether you are going for masters in your uk or whether you are staying in nigeria or whether you have work like me and like i told you that course is not in nigeria i've told you people and that's because they allow only people that has years of experience to do that course but there's a way you can go about it legally without having years of experience and there's an amount um, they pass long journey and that is exactly what i am going for during the course i don't have experience you just have to pass shortcut like this shortcut like this just get like this so and during the course in nigeria you spend like 200k or two hundred and fifty thousand naira. yeah for tuition fee by year and it's a two-year course right depending yeah it's a two-year course you pay 200 and no sorry fast forward you know when you're in your first year you pay more money because of all those departmental fee registration fee that you pay yes so the course in nigeria i told you that they don't have that course in nigeria but there's one that we are using to do uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. so in that two years you spend just and um, what's it called 200k right yeah so let's just budget 500k with tuition fee with accommodation with it but you know which like that too but you know that me i like to package this thing. and it's, it's a government school that you do the course and i don't think this yes I've not stuck, but see, this is what I'll tell you people about. I tell you that the view one is not in Nigeria, but then the one that we go like this, go like this, eh? nobody is like it. I tell you people. So, I'm not scared that what if you don't get nobody because they don't know. Even when I went to different schools to make survey, and I said, um, If I want this course, what are the requirements? They were like, <laughs> We are young, we are not. Me not talk. because even when i want to use this course eh, you know the course is not in nigeria so i want to use eh, man, to pass like this to pass like this hmm? when i met my classmates let me see my classmates when i met them because you know when you sit down to make research in your room in your house you want to come out and say okay let's be realistic is this an achievable or not so i went to different schools that asked this course not the specific course i tell you that specific course not in nigeria that one is just like a bird, kinikon, kinikon. You got me. I'm sure you got me. And I asked them that when I was not talking with them, I I, I got in contact with the classmate that were there and I was asking them. Then and I met one a black guy, you put a very jovial person. Eh? I was not using time to talk to her and everything. And I told the people that even in Nigeria, hmm, people that are doing this um what's it called? This course. They got it through work and these people are working with government organizations in nigeria we all know nigeria job market and i used to tell people when people say there's no job in nigeria there's no money and everything now you know sabi also align your you know there's money in nigeria that was the first time i would know that you can use work and enter government office in nigeria you shock me you shock me so i now have these people that entered with just work to get the job bro. They now say they are going back to school just for what was it, evaluation or anything so that they can pay them to move them to level clinical, you know, those governments, some, some. That was what they told me. So they actually got this job with just their wife. That was what they used to get this job. So a job that can give you, a job that you can use just wife, eh, to enter. You know that vocational course, that one, you don't need anything, right? You don't have your money, you don't need. But this one, something relating to medical, clinical, this thing. You just wife to enter 
and then they are paying you in government organizations. Some are working in the hospitals, some are working in the office, some are working in the I saw government later, and you know that when it comes to government, I don't understand that thing why this course made it so interesting because you know in Nigeria. So these people, when I met them in their classroom, they are still employed, yo. It's not as if they left their job. You know, like other this thing, maybe when you want to proceed to start going to school, right? And they are going to a full time school. That's one of the good things about Nigeria that you, nobody is telling you about. You can be working full time and be schooling full time. You got me? This school is a full time school, but because I do this channel on 98%, let me just say it 98% of my classmates, right? My The people that I met there, they are actually working full time. Huh? And I asked them that. Now that you people left the, your office, who will be attending to your customer? She customer will be client, she are, eh. Then I say, ah, they are there, oh, that people are still there. That there are people that are there, that even if they don't go to work throughout this week, you, go, you people should know how government work is in nice. ah, ah, ah. That's why you to know that, they are, I think that this job is a job that when you get, you are jobless. Do you understand what I'm saying? Like, there are some jobs that it will not even stress your life. It will stress your life, but it will not stress your life. So for you to leave your job, a full-time job in Nigeria, and then go to a full-time school in Nigeria, and you're still living like normal person, you're collecting your salary, you see how people that is taking shit. But then she was not like, they still have to go to work maybe two weekends so that their colleague will not feel like, eh, hey, hey, because when they go to school and everything. And do you know, funny enough, when I was asking these people, right, where do you work? For example, let's say a government hospital is government hospital office A. You where do you work? It's not like government office A, government office A, government office A. This one, government office B, like, you see up to like seven people working in government office A. Another seven people go working in government office B. You know, because it's a different thing, you should see people working in government office A, government office B, government office C. But then you see some group of people, they came together to school from the same office. Some group of people, they came together hmm? from the same office. <laughs> so I was not asking that if seven people can leave an organization. Who is remaining inside the office? You push your tent down to you. How that the boss my boy with that? I've never seen anything. Wait, ah, ah, see, but gone. this seven girl is just kidding. That they have other people there. How did you people get this job in Nigeria? Should they awake? So now purchase my point for that. You put know that I'm very inquisitive. And before I come and tell you people something, I have to be sure that what I'm seeing. And I ask them that this should be your wife now. As far the normal code, Alpha, did you use leg? You know, that's one of the things to ask when you're talking about a course that is valuable or not. Before you come and take money from people, you have to be sure that people that do not have father and mother, that a normal woman in Nigeria can get the job, and people that have leg can get the job, you can. And I ask them, even I'm a very jovial person, if I they like me that way. But the thing is, I don't, I don't like their uniform. But, ah, people that move all over there. Well, if you bring for a kid that move, I abuse them. Let me not like that. You look like. Let me know, say you some people can know it, ah. but that's the uniform I'm going to wear. Ah, I abuse them. That which type of uniform is this one? Ah, and that's one of those people that when you see their uniform, now you gonna wear it, but but the thing is, most of them they will wear mufti from their house when they get to school they will change, but some people wear their uniform. But the thing is, when you're actually inside the crowd, you actually stand out like the uniform actually stand. Move on, lodge on your uniform, you go down, go so ah, go fine, go sexy. She have a uniform, not seen me. I be clinical. I abuse them more. Their uniform is not fine. Let me know, like, say if you think you are going to a school, their uniform is not fine. I even say they should write letter to HOD that ah, we know go go, we know go go. Let them change uniform to something like this. As I was telling you people, I don't even know where I stop. So and I asked them that did they get the job? Did they use leg? Hmm? Like I told you, like you can see like seven people that is from government office, seven people from government office B in that class. That how did they get the job? Some said they um, they did what was it called? They were they were having government opening posting, right? They just applied and that like I think it's this job, you're not struggling with anybody. You're not in competition with anybody. Like you're not in competition with anybody. In fact, when I tell you go, you'll be like, oh really? This is okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. So if a course can actually, if you can actually get a job in Nigeria with this course, with just um, a master, sorry, wank. Hmm? But I told you that that's not the direct course. That's not the direct. You just have to do some things. Again. You just wank in Nigeria. And then, 
you have people in you let people in the office in the hospital or anywhere you are working to come and proceed in your career what does that tell you they're even begging you to come and steal anyways so if you're interested make sure you send a dm is it expensive who oh, not life for you is expensive who oh, your money because this one is a career mm. this thing course who oh, your rapper to tell you the name of the course there's a amount of money you'll pay then to just draw the diagram of the pathway for you, like if you're going for masters if you're going for and some of you might feel like maybe if i send you my piece you feel like oh it's a waste of money my dear you can study your masters in public health in peace or you can study your masters in biology science in peace when you study them when you don't see peace when you don't see job you have to think like this ah but it's not because some people used to feel like it's a waste of money some people used to feel like eh, why would i pay you money for something that is on google there's so many information on Google. Which one can you figure out? Even as I'm talking to some people that might be telling them, okay, where is this one? Where is this one? Where you going to do it? And even if it's this one gone, do you know the password to go and do it or anything? So when I come in to tell you something, I come and pay me. Don't come and feel like, oh, it's a waste of money or anything. But if you feel like it's a waste of money, go and do your master's in public health. You know, follow the usual. Or go and do your master's. Master's in public health. Or you go and do nursing. Mm -hmm. Even nurses. <laughs> Nurses cannot sit beside these people. Mm, no, they can't because yeah, that's it. It is that's the like thing they have. So guys, thanks so much for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in my next video. So if you know you're interested in this course, make sure to send me an email. My team members will send you our rate card. If you're interested, you pay. Then they move you through. And if you know that you've already got. I you know that you already applied for your course in the UK, right? Maybe you apply for your usual master's in public health. If I tell you this course, right? Just change it because let me tell you something. Don't go waste money. There's no point doing a course at the end of your one year master's, two year master. You are dragging care job with people that I don't understand. Hey, money is doing you to waste. As I say, make sure to go for a very valuable course, right? Yeah. Very valuable course. And this one. It's not in the public eye yeah it's a cost that is not in the public eye so anything that is not in the public eye like this i was it for it in the i was working up and they were doing interview up and so and this one is my course i would like to have you my team i will say i i can't wait to have you on board okay we are the we are the we are the if at this time now <laughs> you will not see my uniform but i tell you i don't like this the uniform is not fine for school, the infirm is not fine. Mm. But then, if you are working, the infirm is fine. Mm. But the thing is, there are actually two jobs. Mm? The first one, it doesn't really pay well. But is, if you pass like this, 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 pass like So guys, thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!